Welcome to the One Minute Apologist. One minute apologist. If you had one minute Apologia. to be able to unpack for the audience, Apologetic seeks to give credible answers to curious questions, to give a defense. How can evil reveal God's greatness? You've probably heard the statement before, if God is good, why is there evil? But here is a twist. Can evil demonstrate something beautiful about the greatness of God? Indeed. While many can picture a musical Narnia stain free from sin, few can digest a good loving God who has allowed our world to be permeated with evil. While an evil world tarnished by sin exposes our depravity, with God it provides a greater opportunity for certain attributes of His to be revealed that otherwise would have remained concealed. For instance, because we live in a fallen world, we are able to experience God in a way that would be impossible had there been no fall at all. As evil as the fall was, it has afforded us the opportunity to experience God's grace, mercy, forgiveness, and unconditional love. Had there been no such thing as sin, we would have never understood the length of God's endless love, nor would we understand the depth of God's grace, mercy, and forgiveness. Those attributes are highlighted against our sin. Without sin, what need is there for grace, mercy, and forgiveness? Furthermore, if sin never entered the world, how would we really know that we are loved unconditionally? Perhaps we were loved because of our perfections, but God's love is deeper, richer, and more mature, and it is highlighted against the black backdrop of our depravity. Let us not forget that the greatness of God was revealed most splendidly at the cross where Jesus Christ looked evil into the face and saw our sin and demonstrated through his death that we are loved unconditionally by a gracious, merciful, and forgiving God we like to call Yahweh.